This is the Siemens SC44 charger in N scale by Bachmann. This model was announced earlier in 2022 and was just delivered at the very end of December 2022, spanning into January of 2023. Inside the box, you'll find the model itself packed very securely along with a quick start guide, you might actually want this for this one, an exploded parts diagram, as well as your warranty information. But enough about the paperwork, let's talk about the model. Overall, Bachmann has done a spectacular job in the visual department. The model is true to the prototype, even in this small scale with separately applied grab irons and hoses, sharp text, and a detailed cab interior, which you will be hard pressed to see, but it is there. The stunning visuals don't stop there, though this model is loaded with lighting effects. Of course, we have our standard directional lighting, which supports Rule 17 dimming, but we also have independent flashing ditch lights, which turn on and off accurately to the prototype according to the direction of travel and sounding of the horn and bell. But that's not all. We've got strobe beacons up top, a prototypical red emergency beacon, directional red marker lights on both ends, and interior corridor work lights. The DCC sound version of the model comes equipped with a TCS WOW sound decoder, and I will say this light and sound package certainly delivers on the WOW factor. The sounds are crisp and undistorted and translate well through the locomotive speaker. Let's take a listen.
have your attention, please. Now departing on track three, northbound train number 190. Last call for train number 190 on track three. All aboard. Now arriving on track one, southbound train number 151. Please stand behind the yellow safety line as the train approaches the platform. Only ticketed passengers will be allowed to board the train. In addition to the standard sounds that we've come to expect from a model of this caliber, we also have some really innovative features that I've personally never seen on a model before, all of which revolve around braking and the lights and sounds that come with it. While the logo is moving, hitting function 5 on your DCC system will trigger the train brake. The train will slow down steadily and play appropriate brake squeal sounds until coming to a complete stop, unless you change the throttle setting. Hitting function 5 five times in a row will trigger an emergency brake application. You'll hear the air dump, the train will come to a very quick but not immediate stop, and the emergency beacon will start flashing. The final feature in this category is the Crew Alerter, also known as the Dead Man Brake. This is a safety feature present on most modern locomotives, which exists to make sure the engineer is still alive and awake. The engineer must periodically interact with the controls of the locomotive or the alerter reset button. If they don't, an alarm will sound, and if an action isn't made within a set amount of time, the train will automatically go into emergency and come to a full stop. This model features the same system. The function is optional and can be triggered by turning on function 17. Now fortunately, not like the prototype, all you have to do to reset everything is just move the throttle again, and then you're good to go. Alright, so we've got a good looking model with absolutely blinding lights and a great sound setup, but how does it run? Well, the answer is extremely well. The motor is smooth and quiet, and folks, I dare you to get this thing to lose power because the keep alive it is packing is not messing around. We tested how far the loco would go under keep alive power only at various speed steps, and even at speed step 25, it went a full eight inches before the sound cut out and stopped. In case you haven't been able to tell by the review so far, I am very impressed with this model. Bachman and TCS have done a stellar job in creating this product, and I am excited to continue running and testing it in the months to come. This review was intended to cover the locomotive as it comes out of the box, but one thing that we didn't really cover was the advanced programming and operational modes that the WOW Sound Decoder features. This includes what they call Audio Assist, which will actually guide you through all of the programming options that are available to you. No JMRI, no programming track, no computer hookup, just the loco, and just your DCC system. Welcome to Audio Assist. Use button 1 to hear the sound programming options. If you're a person who is really intimidated by DCC and all of the programming stuff that comes with it, this is TCS's attempt to help you out. After I've had enough proper running time with this model, I'll come back and do a follow-up video to see if everything I've said holds up over time, but until then, please enjoy some running shots of the SC44 with the only Amtrak rolling stock I have available at the moment. Your attention please. Now departing on track 2, northbound train number 130. Passengers are advised to proceed to track 2 at this time. All aboard! <laughs> Thank you. 
Well, if you disliked this video, you could hit the thumbs down button, but if you liked this video, you could hit the thumbs up button, and if you really liked this video, you could hit the subscribe button. Of course, if you'd like to, leave a comment down below, and if you would like to find more train content, you can find it on the channel here on YouTube, or you can go to at CVG Trains on TikTok. I've got a lot of content up there, and if you have a model that you need repaired or would like some help with repairing, you can head on over to CVGTrains.com, where you can submit a repair request to send a model to me to fix. Now listen, I know that you've got a whole bunch of tasks that you have to get done today, but in case you don't actually want to do any of those, you can procrastinate by watching some of these videos over here. Or if you absolutely have to get something done and you just need some like nice background noise, I've got a 20 minute long video of me disassembling and reassembling an N-Scale Atlas SD60. I'm looking out for you. I've got whatever it is that you need. And regardless of what you need, have a fantastic rest of your day. We'll see you next time.